A strong warning was sent out from the Education Secretary's office to make sure no school charges any form of fees. Secretary for Education in a phone interview with MTV this morning says any school found to be breaching this will be dealt with, particularly the school principals. For us to pay schools. So given the uh, increasing number of uh, reports on that we received, we have uh, taken another circular to emphasize that uh, this is not allowed. Uh, schools must comply with the formal instructions that were given by the authorities, and no additional fees must be collected over and above the approved fees. Uh, we are holding the principals accountable. Uh, any financial collection of monies and reporting of funds is the responsibility of every administrator that's the principal or head of the school uh, so we are holding them accountable that uh, if they do defy the instructions and they will be uh, charged suspended and we will also go another step further to uh, suspend them from the payroll the secular was also to remind the provincial education advisors school inspectors and school heads about the government policy and for them to comply too Dr. Combra says the secular was given out after getting numerous reports that some schools are charging fees. Uh, we have uh, numerous reports from many schools around the country that they're collecting uh, school fees and project fees uh, over and above uh, what the government has promised to give and that's approved for us to pay schools. So given the uh, increasing number of uh, reports on uh, that we received, we have uh, taken another secular to emphasize that. The secular applies to general education schools from preschool or elementary up to secondary and to national high schools, fort centers and vocational centers. As per the advice from the education department a week earlier, all the schools throughout the country have started their academic year yesterday. Samantha Solomon, National MTV News.